Right now, Ukraine says that Russian forces are bombing and shelling a factory compound in Mariupol. Look at the pictures there. There are thousands of civilians, Ukrainian officials say, taking shelter there. The besieged port city of Mariupol in the southeast of Ukraine, facing this for weeks now. The last remaining Ukrainian forces defending the city, along with those civilians, hoping to save their lives there, but they're coming under increased fire. We are told that Russian forces are firing at the facility willingly. Here are some of the people inside. Dozens of women, children, the elderly. They've been there for weeks. Mothers say conditions for their children particularly desperate. Not much food. Their children's teeth starting to spoil. This morning, President Biden will hold a call with U.S. allies and partners to discuss how to hold Moscow accountable more. But Moscow's not moving back. And this is just into CNN. Russia, Russia's foreign minister, Sergei Lavrov, states categorically that his country will only use conventional weapons in Ukraine, not nuclear weapons. It should be noted that Lavrov not directly responsible for military decision-making in Russia, but an important, potentially important, public comment. Of course, Russia also said they would not invade Ukraine. And here we are. Ed Lavendera is still...